Cuz, it's me. Good. Yeah, Ray. Man, you got hit in the leg. You don't want to get that looked at? It's not that serious. Okay. Well, I'm Officer Delgado. This is Officer Grace. Can we talk to you for a minute? He's kind of mad right now. Well, we're sorry about what happened. We just want to talk to you for a minute. We're hoping to get a better sense of what happened outside. I know this might be hard, but we're here to help you. And what's your name? I'm his cousin. You're Gary's cousin, and what's your name? Is there a reason you don't want to give us your name? We're not trying to jam you up. We're just trying to figure out who hurt your cousin. No word. Was it your party? What? We were told this is the cousin's home. Are you that cousin? I don't know what you're talking about. Really? Gary, is there anything you can tell us? He's good. He's talking. I say he's good, miss. Okay, why don't you step outside with me for a moment while Officer Delgado and your cousin speak? <laughs> nah, I'm good. Excuse me? We got nothing to say. He don't even feel like talking. Let's go outside. No, for what? I said I'm not going nowhere. Sir, I am telling you to step outside. Yo, how are you just gonna walk hey, in here hey, and hey, think hey, you hey, I just, just do what she says, all right? Oh what? Yo, bro, it's oh what? Cool. Nah, yo. Don't sweat it. Ooh, that's my word, yo. I don't even like ooh. Who called this catch, yo? I see you don't feel like talking. Is it because I'm a cop? I don't got nothing to say. That's it. Well, maybe you can tell me what you remember. For starters, did you see who shot you? Why are you in my face? First of all, keep your voice down. I'm not yelling, why are you in my face? You want to take this down to the station? What's your problem? Nothing. We were fine till y'all walked in here. Just because guns went off? Any other time, y'all be nowhere to be found. That's your problem with us? You don't know the half of it. Okay. Well, let me tell you what I do know. Someone really tried to hurt your cousin. We're here trying to find out who it was, why they did it, if your cousin was the intended target. If we can answer these questions, maybe we can get this person or these people off the streets. Isn't that what you want? Isn't it? I can't force you to speak, but we're still gonna try to figure out who shot you. If you help this out, that would make things easier. You could be helping yourself out. What is it? What? Why'd you smile when I said that? I didn't smile. I saw a little smirk. No, it was nothing. How do you know I'd be helping myself? Well, we're thinking we can find whoever shot up your party if you help us. What are you thinking? I don't really know who it was. I don't remember nothing. I just remember getting shot and it got blurry and then I ended up here. If he remembered anything, would you tell us? He'd be hesitant to. Why? It's none of your business. No disrespect. Well, the housing not my business. We like to take care of ourselves out here. The way cats see it, the less people who know, the better. And if the police know? Y'all just be making us look bad. All around. The next thing you know, y'all asking me about stuff that ain't got nothing to do about nothing. Next thing I know, I feel like I'm the suspect. So you would prefer that whoever did this gets away with it. That's what you're That's saying right now. That's not what I'm saying at all. Well, it's either that or you guys plan on handling this yourselves. Believe me, you don't want to take that route. That wouldn't be possible, miss. We don't have the resources or the knowledge to blast old shitheads. You know what? Go wait downstairs till we're done talking with your cousin. Man. I hope you know you are not doing him any favors. Yeah, well, y'all ain't doing him no favors either. What? Don't act like you care. Go downstairs and wait. Whatever, y'all. Top of that, I'd probably get shot again messing with y'all. Forget about it. I would, but that sounds really serious. I mean, I want to help you, but you're saying that I can get you shot. Or that you can get in trouble talking to us. You feeling pretty sure about how this can go down? So, 
what could happen if you try to handle this yourself? A lot of things could happen. Like what? People would get hurt. You feeling pretty sure about that? If I went to see them, yeah. Could you be the one who gets hurt? Even worse than this time? <laughs> Anything's possible. Would you be willing to take that risk, Gary? Considering what could happen to you or how it could affect your family? Seems like that question really upset you. You got a family? I got a son. Are you thinking about him right now? He was in the house when it happened. He could have lost his father. I got him around this. I'm the one who exposed him to this shit and I gotta take care of him like this. Sorry, man. Sounds like you're really worried about your son's well-being. Could be traumatic for him. I know. So, trying to rectify this on your own could cost him. It's risky. Do you think it's just as risky to let us help you? I don't know. So, you have to decide if you trust us and then weigh your options. You mean talk to y'all or go after them? Or do nothing. Call it a day? Yeah. Right. It's a choice, I'm just saying. Well, I can definitely tell that talking to us feels risky. We want to address that. We want to look out for you. Gary, do you remember anything that happened outside? We were outside. It was supposed to be a little family barbecue.